installing the setup we will first install exam and then later install matilde uh, matilde application here so this is my main operating system which is ubuntu version 20.04 so but i'm not going to install like yeah, yeah, these things on my main operating system instead i'm going to be running you know uh those yeah security testing or vulnerability testing uh in my using virtual machine so and i highly like recommend you to do the same since you know it is not good you know a good idea to perform those hacking tasks you know like using your main operating system so okay so if you don't have any any virtual machine installed yeah i have the link uh, in the description uh like to my video where i explained how to install a virtual machine so without any further delay i'll just you know uh get my my virtual machine up and running so this is my virtual box i do have a three installed virtual machines here the first the first one is kali just for you know penetration testing cd ubuntu and this one this is my first virtual machine this is ubuntu uh version 16.04 if, if i can remember so but yeah i named this one because this was like uh i was just here yeah, recording the video to this on how to install virtual machine so yeah i'll be using yeah this virtual machine here let me go ahead and then start uh, my virtual machine so but if you are if i if i using uh like uh you can use any linux distro you know for these tasks here you know so if you are running your yeah, fedora uh, even centos you know any linux distro will work on this so let me as i wait for my virtual machine to get started you know i just be explaining like uh, how you know the, the steps that we are going to follow in order to install exams and uh yeah this matilda application so uh you meanwhile just go to google and then type x a m p p which stands for cross uh yeah cross platform apache mysql php and per you know so like if we are going to set up a web server you know yeah you need you know like yeah the server especially yeah, the apache even you know database and the scripting language right so uh, let me just type my password here cool yeah i was saying that like if you want to set up like a, a web server on your local machine uh a, a, a server which means a server it is running on your local machine of course you need you know this yeah apache uh mysql even the scripting languages such as php so xamp you know takes care of all of this you can just you know download this one and then install it then it will yeah take care of these things for you cool just go open your browser and then go to can google even duck duck go whatever search engine you use just type uh uh some uh download nice and then yeah just click the first uh link there which is apache and then choose you know uh like the installer of your type here if you're on windows you can um, choose anyone any yeah uh, any packages here so since i'm 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 running linux then i will choose this one cool save so i do have this one downloaded already so just to save my you know uh my mobile data i'm going to be yeah yeah to yeah to skip this one so i'm assuming that you have already downloaded this file and so one once i head to my download here let me just open my terminal Yeah, this is virtual machine it is running very slow it does have some issues so change directly to my download folder i can see it is there up and running so after like after you download this one you need to change you know yeah you, you need you need like to give the uh, the the execution permission you know yeah to this file before you run it just change mode now uh, plus x which is sign for execution then the name of your file cool but mine since it was in green which means it is executable 
one okay nice so if i just uh, check like the permission to this one let's see as you can see it is executable there cool so now what's next oh sorry we need to install this one so in this one just type uh dot slash then the name of your file there then let's wait for the installer to load Oh, requires root privilege, privilege becomes okay, cool, nice. Then I need to run this one with super user do permission, you know. Example, let's see. Okay, good. Then type password here. Yeah. Okay, nice. Just click next. Next. okay good so the setup is now ready to begin installing okay all right good. so this is going to take a while so meanwhile we can not install uh, like download uh, this uh matil matilidi application this is a vulnerable web application that helps you know those people who want to practice their hacking skills or web penetration testing skills they can uh, yeah practice this uh, on vulnerable you know web applications such as you know matilda and even like uh, there's this one is it dw what i don't remember the names yeah but yeah matilda is one of them yeah so just check if you're like uh if you have git installed yeah uh, i do have git installed here so what i'm going to do i'm just going to go go back to the browser here and then i look for matilidi uh github okay nice it is weaponized here so what you're going to we are just going to download uh, this matilidi application and then we yeah we yeah we run it inside you know example there okay cool just come here you can download it as zip and then unzip it later but i prefer using git oh where is this terminal here okay is should i put it here okay no no problem git clone nice okay good so it is cloning now let's see where our setup is it is still installing here let's see okay so even matilda is being downloaded okay nice so matilda is downloaded already let's wait for this setup you know complete and then what we do next we just you know move uh sorry like let me just list the files here see the material material let's see okay cool so what we are going to do next we are going to move this uh folder here inside you know example you know hd docs uh directory there so let's wait for the exam to get complete so i'm going to pause for a while then i will get back once this installation is done and then continue with you cool okay the installation is almost done let me just close this browser here so of uh, uh, click finish and then once you are done so what is next now so what we are going to do we are going to move you know the matil matil dive folder inside you know uh this folder here is the opt yeah slash uh opt yeah slash uh l a m p which is for linux uh you know uh, uh, apache mysql par or php you know hd docs there so we can do this by running this command here uh sudo oh what's wrong with my keyboard okay sudo and then type cp which is done for copy tag r uh tag r since we are copying the whole folder you know here 
then materially die further this one okay so we are going to move it inside like yeah inside hd docs which are in our example you know yeah directory there so just type opt and then a uh, lamp then h uh, slash hd docs okay there cool so let's wait it's okay nice so let's go uh, change our directory to this one and then see if we are going to to find our easy this should be where let's see see up the yeah it should be the opt lamp hd docs so as you can see you can f a as you can see, Matilda is there. So one more thing that we need to do, we are going to change, you know, like uh, like the database password. Uh, you like, so the way you can change this one, we are just going to leave it as as a blank. So when you head to like this uh, this Matilda here, and then change, go to include. Let's see, no cd Matilda. Where is this one? Is it include? slash uh database data include slash database where is this one uh, okay yeah this is a file so i need let's just open it with with the help of nano oh easy uh, include database okay this this file here so we are going to change the the password from matilda die to the just set this as a done just to make things easier here so that you want to be prompted you know uh asking like yeah put the password 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 so just save this one and then okay that's it then uh, just control s then control x yes what's wrong i need to, uh i need to do it with the pseudo permission Okay, let me just exit that one. No, okay, just need to do this sudo include database. Let's see. I just move the cursor there. I need this one as a blank. Okay. okay nice so now we are good to go so now uh, since we have already installed XAMPP and matilda uh, application is inside hd docs there so what you are going to do you are going to set up our web server you, you can easily do this by running sudo uh sudo opt lamp, and then we'll uh, just uh again lamp then start cool so as we can see we are getting a notification saying that you know apache is already running even my sql is running so waiting for pro ftp which stands for like file transfer protocol here for this one okay cool so now let's go to our local you know local host or if we type the local host um uh, till it die we should see our stuff up and running just ignore this error message so what we need to do to set just reset the database and this will be solved i think okay good so this is it as you can see you know OSAP open web application security uh project you know matilda uh, web applications you know good so this is it uh this is all for this video and for the next video i just be showing you how you can run this i mean this matilda application uh, with the help of you know docker as just as a docker image in just you know one second good thank you